now then here we are at Thornaby um, what is it Ex extra prelim round for the FA Cup tonight against Thornaby we're sat here with first team manager Brett what's your, what, what's your, uh, your thoughts on uh, before tonight's game Brett it's, um, it's difficult difficult uh, this is probably hardest hardest decisions we've had to make since me and Bowes now lapses on board because the squad's really strong um, so it's difficult and it's hard hard letting boys down because I know how it is if you cut you want to play in it but we've got to do what's right for us and what we think is right for this game um, so that's that's what we've chosen tonight so yeah some of the lads will be upset but sometimes you can Give, kick, kick them up the back side and then come on and they do it they, they, make, they make a difference so yeah it's, it's what we've got to take it as a thumbs really obviously FA Cup I'd say for teams of our level is quite, it, it, it's massive really if we think about FA Cup and what it brings it's massive obviously what, what's your knowledge of them we're playing tonight for a bit I've, I've never read no, them so. I, like, I used to look into a lot of the teams and stuff like that but now I don't even bother because it's, it's all about tonight it's all about tonight it's all about the day or the night that you play on it's uh, it's ever better than the day, simple as, and it's ever wants it more, whoever's hungry for it. And, and that's how you win the games, you know what I mean? So I don't even look any of those as well that. Sometimes it can, can work against you because you start thinking out of yourselves or you start thinking you're a bit, oh, he's out or whatever, we can beat them. So I don't even look at them anymore. I know, I know Saturday I was saying in the commentary um, on the game that people would hopefully be using Saturday to knock on the door to give you a bit of selection, innit? Do you feel that's happened where, where people are knocking on your door saying, hey, look, boss, give me a start, please? To be honest, um, some of the lads have really impressed me through the pre-season. They've done fantastic, really, uh, and they've, they've cemented the place. So it's, it's difficult. Yeah, Saturday wasn't the best of, best of results. It was the performance was good for the hour, as I've been told, but I don't like those 5-0. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter thing. So we've just got to take it as it comes, take it as we see it. And, and then it'll pan, it'll pan out just nice, hopefully, and, and lads are, are there and not take it to heart, really, that they've been left out in the, in the fight for that place. Obviously, I don't know how it works for teams since I take it, it's gone in already. Like, we all to talk about, obviously, I, I, what we know approximately 35 minutes till kick off, we all to say, yeah. like, until you've gone with up top and stuff like that. Or? Yeah, of course, yeah. We've, um, we've got, we've went for, Bowie's told me that Jamie Chu had, had a very good game very in Preston. Good, very good so, game. Uh, Jamie started tonight. He's, he's started tonight because some folks like Danny Ells couldn't make it. His work commitments just, just didn't let him go. So, we've started with Jamie Chu on the right and Tom Wobby's in the front three now with Will, Will Annan and, and Billy, which has got real energy in there, big presence, and somebody that can unlock the door like Will Annan. So, yeah. He looks good. Pre season, he's caught my eye. I know his, his school and he's obviously been a pre yeah. around football all his life. He's caught my eye, that will add him. He's, he's, done really, he's, he's quality, you know what I mean? I mean, Lewis Taylor's on the bench and he'll be really disappointed. I've just said to him in there, he's probably the one that should be the most uh, grumpy at me, really, because he's been great. But tonight is solely on Andy, the way Andy is. He's a presence on the pitch. He likes to wind people up and, and he can, uh, can also get himself in and about it. So. And you're back for tonight because obviously you've got, got Jenks no doubt sat Jenks is, Jenks is back for you tonight so Jenks is in the, in the middle Jack's on the left and Jack's been outstanding yeah, Jack's been probably the, the outstanding player of the pre-season so this is big for him as well he's got to keep it up and cement his place and uh, Ben Lewis on the right yeah yeah cool well up and Leon Dawson plays on the left it's our, it's, our, it's our first ever pre-match interview so any predictions or I'm just going to talk in 90 minutes Sorry, are, are you brave enough yeah. to put a prediction no, I think I, I think it'll be a close game if I'm honest I think it'll be a 2-1 or, or, or a 3-2 or something like that it'll be close it'll be one goal either. I like a 5-4 just for uh, entertainment value I don't yeah. like 5 goals no they're bad in the half but what I say Brett is that obviously good luck tonight I know how much the FA Cup means to a club on Grid Town so really good luck tonight good and um, we'll catch you later mate put it there no problem cheers speak yeah, to you soon thank you